हेलो स्टूडेंट गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबडी सो माय नेम इज डॉक्टर एस एम खंदारे असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर कॉलेज ऑफ एनिमल हजबेंड्री बारामती सो लास्ट क्लास यू डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द रोल ऑफ लाइफ स्टॉक इकोनॉमिक इन एग्रीकल्चर ओके नाउ टुडे यू आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द टर्मिलॉजी टर्मिनोलॉजी यूज इन लाइफ स्टॉक प्रोडक्शन ओके इन दिस टॉपिक वॉट आर द टर्मिनोलॉजी यूज इन दिस टॉपिक यू कैन सी वन बाय वन ओके फर्स्ट फर्स्ट टर्मिनोलॉजी इट इज कॉल्ड एज ब्रीड breed is the group of animals related descent and which are similar in most of the characteristics like general appearance size color horns and its colors breeds okay breeds means these are the breeds uh, it is important general characteristics appearance like size color horns kaisa hai color kaisa hai size kaisa hai uh, example of this breed suppose you see the uh, killer breed it is white color horns are long okay so like that this is the example of breed then next is species species is a group of individuals which have certain common characteristics that distinguish them uh, from other group of individuals with uh, species individuals are fertile when different species they are not fertile species means there is a individuals uh, certain common characteristics are present like that suppose species you can bovine ovine caprine avine okay so this species it is a particular group and same uh, character is present okay it is called as species then next is sire sire means the male parent of calf it is called as sire dam means the female parent of the calf it is called as female parent of the calf then calf what is in by calf okay marathi it is called as vasu so young one of cattle or buffalo below the age of 6 month it is called as calf and the below the 6 month of age of uh, uh, age of, uh, young one it is called as calf then heifer heifer means the younger female of cattle above the age of 6 month uh, to the first calving okay it is called as heifer then cow cow is the adult female cattle from the date of first calving is called as cow okay it is example like that uh, year of 1 to 3 year it is called as cow it is mature okay then bull it is the uh, unsaturated cattle used for breeding covering of cow it is a brooding purpose of uh, it is called as bull okay so then bullock it is uncastrated male or cattle used for the work it is not a production of the uh, production of the young one okay it is uh, this bullock it is used for the uh, uh, like that uh, uh, it is road transportation like that uh, it is called as a also in farmer or uh, Uh, cultivation of farmer it like that this bullock it is called as bullock okay service means the process in which uh, mature male cows that female in the heat which uh, object to deposit spermatozoa in the female genital tract it is called as service service means this is not service service means at the time of female it is heat then you have to naturally service is provide and then deposition of semen or it is called as protozoa in genital organ it is called as service conception means the successful union of male and female gamete okay you know the male and female gamete also study about the in a uh, uh, 10th class like that so okay male and female gamete is fused and importance of the zygote it is uh, it is implantation of zygote it is called as conception okay then gestation uh, it is the condition of female when uh, developing fetus present in the uterus gestation okay gestation means uh, there is a uh, period or time period it is a present suppose you have to pregnancy the fetus it develop into the uterus the first time it 9 month it is human being 9 month and 10 month okay suppose in cattle different gestation periods like that okay so it gestation period the period from the date of service actually uh, conception to the date of uh, parturition term it is called as uh, parturition period it is called as pregnancy period okay so at that term uh, gestation period means Uh, nine months suppose human being nine months uh, delivery like that sir same in cattle like that so different periods are uh, given to the uh, gestation period okay next parturition the act of giving birth to young one it is called as parturition then lactation period the period after parturition in which the animal produce milk it is called as lactation period dry period the period of the lactation in which the animal does not produce milk it is called as dry period so calving intervals means the period between the two successive calving it is called as calving interval calving means first javes ek gai vela nantar dusri vela si tya don periods are it is called as calving period tyachanantar herd average herd average is daily milk yield 
milking animal in herd the total milk yield of the day a uh, formula like that h is equal to total milk yield per day uh, divided by number of milking animals kit animals milking hote the divided kare chhe okay fertility means ability of animal to produce large number of living one it is called as fertility fecundity it is the potential capacity uh, female to produce functional ova fecundity means the capacity of female to produce functional ova to regards uh, what happens to them after they are produced it is called as fecundity sterility means it is inability to produce any offspring inability to reproduction it is called as sterility sterility then free martin it is a sterile heifer form uh, twin with the male manje it is sterile male and female uh, it's called as free martin then cryptotism it is the uh, disease condition the failure of testes descend fully into the scrotum failure of testes testicle in the organs of uh, male organs it is called as uh, bull it is called as cryptorin and it is a uh, descend fully into the scrotum or failure it is called as cryptorism nantar at avism it is a reappearance of character after it has not appeared for one or more generation it is called as avatism then teaser it is a vasectonized skim or castrated bull used for the take the heat or stress female it is called as teaser bull then next herd herd it is a group of cattle or buffalo it is called as herd it is called as kalap apan manto kalap then flock it is the group of sheep and goat and poultry it is called as flock group of uh, animals then steer the male cattle that gestated when he is still calf before the developing sexual maturity it is called as steer then wean the meat of calf below the age of 3 months it is called as wean the beef the meat of cattle uh, past calf uh, stage it is called as beef then after 3 month above it is called as beef meat Uh, then pork it is the meat of swine the pig pig meat it is called as pork then mutton it is also called as the meat of sheep and goat then chewon the meat of goat then proliferacy uh, proli proliferacy ability to produce large number of offspring the animal is said to be the polyphile large number of reproduction portion that is called as polyphile then puberty it is the period of reproduce tract secondary sexual organs and characteristic start form acquire their mature form at the stage of mature it uh, produce a sexual secondary characteristic like that okay it is called as puberty then fetus uh, the term of fetus is developing young one during the last quarter of pregnancy it is called as fetus it developing young one last three quarter it is called as fetus uh, look at this uh, general information of this chart you can see the what are the uh, species female male young one what is young one is called as that act of parturition what is act of parturition is called as an average life years okay in this cattle uh, it is called as cow female uh, male it is called as bull young one is called as calf and act of parturition is called as calving year is average life say 16 to 20 years then second one is local buffalo uh, uh, it is called as male uh, female buffalo then buffalo bull calf and it is called as calve then goat it is called as doe do 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 it is it is spelling mistake doe do uh, female is called as doe and male is called as buck and young one is called as kid and act of parturition is called as kidding okay then next sheep uh, young one female it is called uh, female is called as ewe male is called as ram and young one is called as lamb and uh, act of parturition is called as lamb and 12 to 15 years uh, life span then next swine it is called as female one is called as sow male one is called as bow and young one is called as litter and act of parturition is called as furrowing 8 to 10 years then horse horse the female one is called as mare and male one is called as stallion and young one is called as foal and whelping it is act of parturition and 12 18 to 12 years then fowl fowl means the chicken or poultry uh, fowl, female one is called as hen male one is called as cock and young one is called as chick and it is act of parturition is called as hatching the life span of this uh, fowl it is 3 to 4 years okay so justly uh, understand for this uh, uh, terminology in this discussion about that okay so you first of all you read carefully understand it and what are the meanings are there 
you can uh, write uh, it is right and these terminology uh, terminology used in the next topic for the animal livestock production management okay so thank you for this uh, discussion uh, listening of this video